So I got my first phone, mm. cell phone ever, with my brother. We shared the same phone, the same number. It was a cricket wow. phone. That's so when you smart. get a cricket phone, and you're on the south side of town, you get picked <laughs> on. It was terrible. My phone installed the antenna. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I remember I had a pink razor. Are you I, serious? Oh yeah, the flip phone. It was awesome. Oh, you was you was showing out in school. Oh yeah, yeah, I was. That's I awesome. Was. You had the antenna. You remember your first phone? You don't forget it. You don't all you can do is text and call on it. That's yep. It. That's all you can do. Yeah. Say, I was else. impressionable because nobody called my phone. <laughs> Um, how's it looking outside? <laughs> right now, not too bad. It was a great weekend here across Michiana. We're carrying that over here on a Monday. But hey, take a look at this stat. It's been a long time and no rain. Our last uh, trace of water to go back to August 18th. Now, if you count that with me here on these lines, the lack of rain, that's 11 days that we have gone without any type of measurable rain here across Michiana. Now that is going to change as we head on to Tuesday as a cold front does begin to work its way through parts of Michiana. That will offer some of us a sip to a brief nice drip of water here as we head on into tomorrow. We're calling it about a 40% chance of water headed our way between 3 and 9 p.m. And then we'll shut off the waterworks by midweek Wednesday, Thursday, and it's going to be another long stretch uh, without water here across Michigan. Live look at 16 Doppler Max. We're completely dry up and down the board in a bluebird sky out there. Just maybe one or two clouds. Uh, that's about it. You certainly could count the clouds on a day like this Monday. Cold front up to our north and west, just north of the Twin Cities right now. There's some green specks there. Those are a few scattered showers, and that's going to increase uh, increase towards Michigan here as we head towards tomorrow. Putting all this data here into future track, we're going to stay completely quiet for the rest of this evening. And then as we go on forward into Tuesday, we're going to start off the day rather on the drier side at 7 a.m. But make sure the kiddos maybe have that rain umbrella handy for the afternoon hours. Once we get past 2, 3 p.m., that's all we'll have to watch out for some very light rain showers coming on through. Very small chance that one or two of these may have a brief clap of thunder. Otherwise, we're just talking some light showers at times here across Michiana for the evening commute. And the Bay 8, 9 o'clock, this is out of Michiana. And behind this, we're going to see our winds switching directions out from the south to the north for Wednesday. And that's going to lead to some cooler temperatures for Wednesday. In fact, Wednesday, it's going to be a great day maybe just to power off the air conditioner unit open up the windows and let in the fresh air. We're looking for high temperatures on Wednesday right around 70 degrees. And once we head on into a Wednesday night, we could be looking at a few upper 40s here across the area. What are we looking at for rainfall amounts? Well, again, just a sip to a quick, nice drink of water. We're looking at anywhere from around 10th to around a quarter of an inch of water between Tuesday 3 p.m to 9 p.m. First alert 10 day again, very comfortable weather headed our way and continuing on through about midweek and then all eyes on the heat and humidity starting to return for the weekend. I think we'll have to wait until Sunday though before we really start to talk more in depth about that air you can wear right now from Notre Dame's home game here into South Bend. We're looking at a nice one out there, but a toasty one. Looking at upper Ooh. 80s inside what? the stadium Saturday afternoon and then notice what? there in bold letters there heat wave. Another one headed our way here for the tail end of Labor Day weekend yeah. and into the first few days of September. It's just, good. Just when you think fall is here, mm -hmm. yeah. Michiana. Don't close do up the pools nope. just yep. yet. <laughs> yeah, not no. yet. Not yet. All right. Got right. some more boating to go, right? <laughs> Thanks so much. Coming up, kids losing coverage. We'll tell you why thousands of children across the country are now losing their health care benefits. Oh, that is coming up. Do not go anywhere. Stay with us.